Okay, guys, I'm back into Emily Aking. Um, dark chocolate fudge brownie. So excited to do this. So let's go. First, you want to preheat your oven to 350. Okay. Okay, so after that, you want to grease the bottom of the pan. You want to grease your pan. Next, you want to add about a one-third cup of water, one-third cup of oil, vegetable oil, and you want to add your bread mix. So first, I'm going to start with the egg. Actually, I'm gonna start with the water. Then eggs. Okay. Okay. Ew. So I'm gonna go through this right now. Okay, so now you should have your one egg and your bowl full of water and yolk. Next, next you want to add your oil, your vegetable oil. And then your brownie mix. Mm -hmm. All of it. I'm just gonna put this back in. So then you wanna start stirring up. Okay, guys, so I'm about done. It looks like pure chocolate. You got still got a little bit of um, oh, things at the bottom, so I'll try to scoop it up. Um, oh, guys, I think I got it all. I thought I needed more water, but it was fine. Okay, so then, after you do that, you want to put it into the yeah, put it into the pan. Ooh, chocolate! I can't wait to try this. With the little. Okay, you want to continue it. So I'm just gonna start by scooping it from the edges. There. And you want to scoop, put it close to the bowl. Then make sure the batter spread out evenly on the uh, pan. Okay. All that chocolate. Can't wait to try this. Okay, so you spread it evenly. Still gotta get the most of the batter out. <laughs> it's so like thick. But looks fine. Okay, so I'm gonna spread it out evenly. Okay, so this side doesn't have any batter, but I have a lot more. Just have a lot. Just spread it evenly. Across your pan. Almost done with the batter. <laughs> Looks pretty good so far. Oh, I'm I thought it was almost done. Look at all the. Oh, here's some more over here. Some more over here. I need to evenly spread this. 
I think I got like one more. Okay. Holy. Oh, okay. Stop that. Side. Boom. Oh, wow. Okay. So I've gone it all in. So I'm just now going to evenly spread it across the pan. Then you want to put your batter in the oven after it's done preheating. Okay. batter in the oven. Close it. And then you want to set the timer to about 30 minutes. But it depends on what type of pan size you're doing. So if you're doing an 8 by 8 which I'm doing, then 31 to 34. 9 by 9, 27 to 30. Or 13 by 9, 21 to 23. I'm doing it by eight, so it goes thirty. Okay, and a little bit more. Okay, for thirty. So now I just wait for it to finish, and then I take the brownies out. Hey guys, so I made the brownies. It's cooked the way. Now I'm gonna let it cool, and then I can eat it. I'm gonna cut it this way. so good you can see the white spots it's part of sugar it's all falling apart but it's so gooey and good i like it guys i finished tasting tasty tasting the brownie it was good Ooh, so delicious more delicious than i thought it. i didn't think it would come out good but it did so i'm so happy with that now i have a dessert to eat for, for a while now well, anyways uh, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit that like button and to subscribe. Bye.